Yeah, you know, it's a little bit crashed here and there. You know. Looks kind of nasty, but the we have to change the, the 2013. Yeah, so the bumper's broken. Full front. the new hood but you know it, it doesn't it doesn't it doesn't fit it doesn't fit in here so now i gotta wait for someone to either come pick me up or i'm just gonna be stranded out here until i die yep bye lord and savior Skirt. take two oh new bumper it looks like it'll fit everything, all the hinges and everything. Looks like they match. So today I'm probably just gonna swap out the pieces and the hood and crap like that, add that and place it on later. Yep. Ooh. Ta -da. Ta -da. <laughs> he hoses fit. Cool. Bro, I'll we'll go ahead and pull it out. Got the AC condenser on. filter tighten everything up and this should be good to go nice little air box right here all the air is going to come in straight into the intake and then straight into the throttle body very nice i like <laughs>
All right, all right, all right. For those of you wondering how to initiate launch control in Audi S4, you come over here, you see it's in drive, you pop this down one time, and it goes into sport right there. See that S? Sport. And then you go ahead over here, put traction control, you take it off, wherever that is. Okay, it's off, it's not focusing though. And you come over here, drive select, you go until it hits dynamic. Okay, and once it hits dynamic, you put your left foot on the brake, you hammer the throttle, and it puts it up to 3,000 RPM, and you just launch yourself. Oh, I didn't have my eyes on the road. I was going all over the place. But yeah, that's how you do it. Yeah.